Hey y'all, it's Jude. Um, hopefully this doesn't uh, look too bad. I, I'm using my wife's ring light. So um, my wife teaches for VIP Kid. So she is here with me in Tampa, Florida. But she teaches kids in China, um, mostly in Beijing, I think, uh, to speak English. So I'm borrowing her ring light and her office which is why there's this lovely, lovely uh, rainbow behind me. I am pretty new to YouTube. Um, I mean, <laughs> making YouTube videos, I guess. Um, I am a trans man, so I was born assigned female at birth, um, and I am a dude, so that is fun for me. Uh, I am hoping to do like an intersection of trans stuff as well as um, disabled topics. I have English Danlos syndrome, so uh, some days are better than others, but I am chronically ill. Um, sometimes I use a wheelchair, uh, it actually helps a lot. I just got my first wheelchair a couple weeks ago, and it's been amazing to have. Um, I will probably do um, videos about DIY stuff for wheelchairs because I have tried to search for my own helpful, like, like I've tried to search for DIY stuff on wheelchairs and there's like nothing out there. So I'm hoping to add to that content. <laughs> um, sorry that I sound a little bit sick. I have an ear infection right now and just kind of an upper respiratory fun mess going on. Um, other things about me, I am neurodivergent, so I am on the autism spectrum. Um, I also have other comorbidities. Comorbidity is like things that just kind of go along with Ehlers-Danlos. So I am partially deaf. Um, I have narcolepsy. Uh, I have something called HMPP, which is hereditary neuropathy with um, pressure palsies. So, like, if I sit for more than about 30 seconds in one spot, then, uh, like, my legs just fall asleep. Or my arms. Or, like, right now. If I just even have, like, my arm bent like this, then my entire forearm and my hand will fall asleep in about... 30 seconds. So I have to move a lot just to keep that from happening. And I'm here to kind of spread awareness and talk about stuff that is important to me. Um, hopefully it reaches some people that it can make a difference to. I, I don't know. Um, Sorry, I feel like I'm saying um a lot as well. This is like, this is literally like my first video, so <laughs> sorry about that. I am hoping to do kind of intersectional videos of trans and disabled and hearing loss and wheelchair stuff. Uh, let me know if there's anything that you would like to see on my channel, and I'm open to discussions about it. I'm married. Um, my wife is Marissa and she is wonderful and perfect and I love her. We've been friends for a really long time. We've been, uh, I, she's actually my first roommate in college, um, ironically, <laughs> before I ever came out as trans and she is wonderful. Uh, we got married in 2018 and it was the best thing I've ever done. <laughs> Uh, I am also a grad student because I am just that crazy that I went back for more school after my bachelor's. It took me a really long time to get my bachelor's because of chronic illness as well as uh, ADHD so um, and mental health. I had a lot of mental health issues um, until I found meds that really worked for me specifically. So it actually took me like a decade to get my bachelor's and now I am working on a master's in data science because I am a numbers nerd and I love crunching numbers and I love data. So I'm actually between jobs right now because while I love data, 
not a lot of companies understand the value of long-term data analysis and control. So my jobs tend to be that I come in and fix things, and then uh, because things are working now, I don't have a job anymore. I tend to work out myself, work myself out of a job quite a lot. So uh, right now I'm looking for my next job, and I thought, well, I have time uh, other than my thesis, which I should be doing. Um, might as well try out my hand at YouTube. So that's me. I'm trans guy doing data science in a wheelchair, doing wheelies and shit. Um, and I have an awesome seven-year-old nephew who is not related to me, but he's my best friend's uh, son, and he's amazing, so you'll probably see him on the channel a few times. He loves to talk to everyone, so I'm sure he will mind. Uh, he literally talks to everyone. He is super, super extroverted and adorable. Um, I guess I'll leave it off here, but if there's anything you'd like to see on this channel, just leave it in the comments and let me know if anyone even sees this. <laughs> Bye guys.